KTM. KTM AG, Kraftfahrg Trunken Pauls Matagofen, formerly KTM Sport Motorcycle AG, is an Austrian motorcycle, bicycle and sports car manufacturer owned by Pura Mobility AG and Indian manufacturer Bajaj Auto International Holdings BV. It was formed in 1992 but traces its foundation to as early as 1934. Today, KTM AG is the parent company of the KTM Group, consisting of a number of motorcycle brands. KTM is known for its off-road motorcycles, Enduro, Motocross and Supermoto. Since the late 1990s, it has expanded into street motorcycle production and developing sports cars, namely the Expo. In 2015, KTM sold almost as many street as off-road bikes. From 2012, KTM was the largest motorcycle manufacturer in Europe for four consecutive years. Globally, the company is among the leading off-road motorcycle manufacturers. In 2016, KTM sold 203,423 motor vehicles worldwide. In 1934, an Austrian engineer Johann Trunkenpaul set up a fitters and car repair shop in Matagofen. In 1937, he started selling DKW motorcycles and Opel cars the following year. His shop was known as Kraftfahrg Trunkenpaul's Matagofen, but the name was unregistered. During the Second World War, his wife took care of the business which was thriving mainly on account of diesel engine repairs. After the war, demand for repair works fell sharply and Trunkenpaul started thinking about producing his own motorcycles. The prototype of his first motorcycle, the R100, was built in 1951. The components of the motorcycle were produced in-house, except for the Rotax engines which were made by Fichtel and Sachs. Serial production of the R100 started in 1953. With just 20 employees, motorcycles were built at a rate of 3 per day. KTM entered motorsports competing in motocross racing. KTM won its first championship in 1974 when Gennady Masef claimed the 250cc motocross world championship. By the end of 2016, KTM had won more than 260 world championship titles, making the company one of the most successful brands in motorsports. KTM has claimed 96 MXGP, MX1 and MX2 world titles since 1974 and 114 E1, E2, E3 and Super Enduro world titles since 1990. With Ryan Dungey's 2015, 2016 and 2017 victories in the Supercross World Championship, KTM gained a successful presence in Supercross racing as well. In 1994, a KTM factory team debuted at the Dakar Rally. In 1998, KTM riders won 2nd to 12th place. With consecutive wins from 2001 to 2019, the manufacturer has dominated the rally for 18 years now. KTM teams successfully compete in other rally raid events like the Atlas Rally or the Rally du Maroc. KTM has won 37 cross-country rallies world titles since 2003 and has won the FIM Cross-Country Rallies World Championship 15 times, most recently in 2015. In 2003, KTM started sponsoring and supporting road racing in various capacities, with the most successful results stemming from their supermoto efforts. From 2003 to 2009, a KTM factory team competed in the 125cc class of the Motorcycle Grands Prix, and between 2005 and 2008 in the 250cc class. Notable successes in the 125cc class were the second and third place in the overall ranking scored in 2005 by KTM riders Mika Kallio and Gabor Talmixi, the second place in 2006 by Mika Kallio, the third place in 2007 by Tomoyoshi Koyama and the 2005 KTM victory in the 125cc Constructors Championship. In the 250cc class, Mika Kallio won third place in 2008. Since the first Rookies Cup season in 2007, KTM has supplied the bike for the Red Bull MotoGP Rookies Cup. In 2009, KTM announced their withdrawal from Grand Prix motorcycle racing in all classes, and did not return until 2012 in the new Moto3 class. In 2012, KTM won the Moto3 Manufacturers Championship. During the next season, KTM riders prevailed in every race of the Moto3 class and won the world title as well as second and third place, making KTM the obvious victor of the manufacturer's standing. KTM won the manufacturer title in the 2014 and 2016 as well as the world title in 2016 in the Moto3 class. Starting in 2017, KTM fields bikes in both MotoGP and Moto2 classes as well. The main class team features Bradley Smith and Paula Spargaro as full season riders, and Mika Calio as wildcard rider. The Moto2 KTM Aho team features Miguel Oliveira and Brad Binder. 
steadfastly independent and confident of their company's abilities, KTM chose to use a steel trellis frame where all other manufacturers used aluminum. In addition, KTM insisted on developing their own racing suspension through their WP subsidiary, all other manufacturers used Olintz. KTM demonstrated their prowess in doing things their own way by winning their first MotoGP Premier Class race on August 9, 2020, with rookie Brad Binder crossing the finish line in first place. From 2009 to 2011, KTM teams competed in the IDM, the Superbike International German Championships. There were speculations about a possible KTM 4A into the Superbike World Championship. Due to the company's focus shifting away from the RC8 and generally Superbike design, these plans are off the table for the foreseeable future. KTM's official company slash team colors are orange, black and silver. To create a strong brand identity, all competition-ready KTMs come from the factory with bright orange plastic with KTM emblazoned on the side of the radiator shrouds. All KTM bikes also come from the factory with a Motorex sticker on the outside of the motor. All first fills of oil come from Motorex as well. Some official KTM teams use different colors for their bikes, most noticeably in the Dakar Rally.